right about now, you're about to be possessed by the sounds of MC Rawfish. the floor for Philadelphia. The dynamic duo of Harris and Embiid at the four and the five. Maxi out there with James Harden. And it's Thibel in at the three spot. Yep, count it. Embiid's got eight points. Yeah, the focus of the defense. I mean, James Harden was able to use that attention and turn it into a hoop for someone else. And it's out of bounds to Minnesota. And let's take this time to bring up the list of last season's elite shot blocking teams. Second, Philadelphia. In the third spot, the Timberwolves. One look at last season's shot blocking numbers, and it's clear that these are two squads that love to play the physical game down in the paint. Now here's Beverly. Pass to Russell. Three pointer. Nails it from beyond the arc. He's got five. In catch and shoot situations, you've got to be balanced and in control. Mr. Russell, well done. Inside, stolen by Russell. Towns on a screen. Shot clock at five. Pass to Beverly. Takes it inside. And he banks in the layup. This guy is such an intelligent guard. Patrick Beverly finding a driving lane and finishing. Fantastic ball movement for them tonight. If things are definitely working offensively, a balanced attack is just so much harder to defend. Three-pointer, Harden. Another three for Philadelphia. And his fantastic performance from the last game has carried over to tonight. Now, I think that's the one thing every player is searching for, consistency. They're giving this guy a chance to carry the offense once again. Here's Vanderbilt. And here's Russell. Back to Vanderbilt. Six on the shot clock. Over Harris. That one a little long. Philadelphia shooting about 41%. And the ball out of play. The Timberwolves will have it. For Minnesota, they've got two of three from the floor in this third quarter. Russell, double team. Pass to Towns. Outside for Russell. Towns on a screen. Snatched away. Beverly against Harden. Dival on the wing. 
Right side, Harden. This one for three. And it's out of bounds. They say it was last touched by Harden. McDaniels has checked in for the Timberwolves. Jaden McDaniel. The Timberwolves trail. Left side, Russell. The offensive rebound. And blocked. That one goes careening off the glass. Pass to Maxi. Now Harden, Beverly defending. Harris outside. Three-pointer. Towns with a rebound. Towns has got four rebounds in the game. Here's McDaniels. Towns is screen on Harden. Here's Russell. And that one comes up a bit short. Philadelphia has gone just one of three from deep since the break. Beverly with a steal. Third quarter of basketball here. A little under three and a half minutes gone by. Here's Towns. Another miss. Boy, they're in a funk right now. I'll tell you, no matter what he does, he can't find his rhythm, and you get the sense he's starting to press a little bit. Well, obviously, the defense has not been great this half, and you've got to be able to address this quickly. They're searching for a way to score. Yeah, buckets have been very tough to come by. Here's McDaniels, pounded by Harris. And it's Russell on the drive. And it's blocked by Embiid. Harden against Beverly. Outside Harden, from deep. Russell with the rebound. Not himself from range right now. But the only way out of this funk is to keep trying. What a nice little burst from Patrick Beverly to get in transition. The 76ers have gotten three of six shots to fall so far in the third. Harris outside. Pass to Embiid. And so it looks like it'll be Philadelphia ball. Just a millisecond late. So close to coming up with a steal there. Absolutely appreciate the effort, though. He really went after it. So close. Prince has checked in for Beverly. Here's Maxi. He's got five. Six to shoot. Here's Harris. Oh, yes, the turnaround. Harris has got seven points in the game. An understanding that the mid-range jumper is not dead. I love it. Harris is dependable and takes smart shots. Here's Prince. That falls. Nice assist by Russell. Well, you offer no resistance defensively. He's going to knock down the three. It's really that simple, guys. Embiid a screen on Edwards. Harden into the lane. And there it is for him. James. Harden's got five points in the quarter. Harden just loves scoring through contact. He seeks it out while trying to get fouls on his shooting attempts. Minnesota's gone two for two from deep here in the third. Pass to McDaniels. Here's Towns. Embiid covers. Dybal on the wing. Outside Harden. With the jam. Oh, you cannot allow Harden this type of positioning because he's going to dump all over you when you do. The Timberwolves shooting just 36% in the third. Here's Edwards. And it's blocked by Thibel. Harris with it. Working on McDaniels. Harris, a screen on Edwards. Pass to Thibel. Fires for three. Minnesota with a rebound. It's McDaniels on the wing. Ooh, and once again, off the mark by Minnesota. Now here's Harris. Rebound Minnesota. Edwards got seven rebounds in the game. It's hauled in by the Sixers. Embiid's got the glass covered here tonight. That's 11 boards for him. Harden finds Harris. Back to Harden. There's the drive. Oh, and makes it with the kiss. Harden's got nine points now in the second half.
<laughs> it is so difficult to guard Harden on the drive. Tremendous finishing at the hoop, but he's also elite at drawing fouls. Now here's Edwards. He's got 11. Here's Prince. Gets the three ball to go. Prince has got six. As the deep shots continue to fall, you can sense the frustration growing among these defenders. The 76ers have gotten seven of 12 shots to drop in the third. Harden, the pass to Embiid. And then Embiid with the dunk. And he's now got the double-double. Yeah, it's rare that one of the game's best scorers is also one of the best playmakers. Harden does it all at the offensive end. Now here's Edwards. Out to the wing. Here's Russell. Rebounded by James Harden. Harden's got six rebounds here tonight. And Maxie, here we go. And the powerful one-handed slam. Everyone James knows Harden is a talented passer. He can really rack up those assists. Minnesota has gone three of four from outside in the second half. To the wing on the left. Here's Russell. And he converts the layup. Russell's got five points in the quarter. It's not easy to work the ball inside in this league, but they've done it all night. There's a minute 54 left in the third quarter. And the 76ers call time here. I don't think this timeout is just to give the guys a breather. Coach is looking to switch things up. And as you know, it's what comes after that gives you some sense of what has changed. All right, look who's coming on to the court. Come on and get loud for your Minnesota Timberwolves dancer. And the Timberwolves will go for a different look here. Reed's checked in for Carl Anthony Towns. Okogie comes in for McDaniels. Noel, he's checked in for Anthony Edwards. And it's McLaughlin in for Russell. 151 left to play in the third quarter. The fader. Hillstaff can't get it to go. And for the Timberwolves, they're shooting just around 32% from the field. Here's McLaughlin, covered by Milton. Off target from three-point range. Philadelphia has gotten only one three-pointer to fall here in the third. Five attempts. Pass to Korkmaz. And another miss by Philadelphia. The Timberwolves shooting just about 33% since this second half started. And it's McLaughlin missing. And for the 76ers, they're shooting an excellent rate of 56% on the third quarter. And it's Green missing. Green's got one three-pointer tonight so far in four tries. Here's McLaughlin, covered by Milton. And it's McLaughlin missing. Never easy to stop this guy at the rim, but that is a beautiful contest right there. And it's hammered home by Green. <laughs> Attacking the rim with power. Tremendous finish. There's 45 seconds left in the third. Here's Noel. Driving in. Banked it in off the glass. Noel's got six. This is what we call highly efficient play. Working off the screen, getting to the cup. Here's Milton. It's a 13-point game. Korkmaz on the wing. Sinks it from Korkmaz. distance. Korkmaz. Korkmaz has gotten his second bucket of the game. <laughs> They're fortunate to be leading after shooting below 40% in the first half. Akogi on the wing. Tried to come right back with a three of his own, but it's no good. Korkmaz on the wing. Outside, green. Another three for Danny Philadelphia. Green. Well, this guy three is points. a lethal distance shooter. Danny Green lights out. And as we end the third That's quarter, a double-digit deficit score. will make it tough to come back. Sixers ahead, up 19. And coming up as soon as we return from break, the fourth quarter gets underway. there have been two very different performances from these teams today as we get going in quarter number four.
got Naz Reed. Torian Prince is out there with Jared Vanderbilt. Then it's Jordan McLaughlin. And it's Noel in at the shooting guard position. So that's the Timberwolves five. Well, that possession to me highlights the importance of creating for your teammates. And it's the Sixers with the ball. And after this game wraps up, they're off to New York to take on the Knicks. And that game will mark the end of a four-game trip. Outside, Green. Pass to Nia. Over to the wing. Just four to shoot. Here's Millsap. Oh, plenty of contact on that shot. Officials call the foul, and he'll take two free throws now. It's going to be on Naz Reed. A polished veteran with an entree of moves at his disposal. Millsap knows how to keep defenders on their toes. And the Timberwolves will go for a different look here. Carl Anthony Towns has checked in for Reed. McDaniels comes in for Prince. Anthony Edwards has checked in for Noel. And D'Angelo Russell subbed in for McLaughlin. And Philadelphia also making a switch. Harden's checked in. So hits one and misses one at the line. Minnesota with the ball. It's an 18-point game. And he stays with it. Edwards, the pass to Towns. Back to Edwards. Here's Vanderbilt, defended by Harden. And Danny Green gets the whistle that time. That's his first foul of the game. And the 76ers with some changes. Embiid comes in for Millsap. And Tobias Harris subbed in for Nia. Tobias Harris. Outside Russell. Six on the shot clock. And book it for Vanderbilt. We've seen that more than once today. An effortless basket inside. We played just over a minute here in the fourth. Here's Maxi. Here's Harris. Using his post moves to get the two points. And the 76ers lead by 18. To the left side wing. Here's Russell. And then Russell with the dunk. Wow. I'll tell you, such an advantage having a playmaker who can get up to the rim and finish. Now that is what every team wants. Well, you love it. Fearless, aggressive, leaving. No doubt whatsoever. And here are the Sixers now. The Timberwolves getting their last shot to go. Embiid misses. Outside Edwards. Pass to Russell. There's the drive. Uses the glass to finish the layup. That's 10 straight points they've given up in the painted area. Huh. And so here is Philadelphia. They lead by 14. Out left to the wing. Here's Maxi. Harris on the wing. Back to Maxi. Clock at six. Harris is screen. Fires from deep. And it's rebounded by Carl Anthony Towns. The Timberwolves have gotten four or five attempts to fall so far in the fourth. Fires from 14. Not going to go that time. Now the 76ers take it the other way. Harden from outside. Vanderbilt pulls it in. Vanderbilt's got 10 rebounds here tonight. So active. And here's Edwards outside. Pure from three-point range. Well, don't think twice. Ball touches your hands. You let it go, Anthony Edwards. The 76ers have gone one of four since the fourth quarter began. Embiid, a screen on Edwards. Edwards against Harden. Embiid with it. Pass to Maxi. Down to five on the shot clock. Three-pointer. Harden fires in the triple. Harden. Harden's got 12 points here in the second half. Challenging this D with the three ball. That's his second from distance this half. And he also hit one in the first half, too. Here's Vanderbilt. And here's Edwards. Shoots over Harden. And it's Philadelphia with the rebound. Embiid's got a rebound number 12 here already in the game. Outside, Green. 
Back to Maxi. On the wing, Green. No good with the triple. The Timberwolves have gone five of eight from the field so far in the fourth. To the inside. Pass to Vanderbilt. The kick out to Edwards. Here's McDaniels. Outside Edwards. The Timberwolves need to get off a shot here. The shot by Russell. No good. Philadelphia has gone one for five from downtown here in the fourth. For three, Maxi Towns with a rebound. Towns has got six rebounds now in the game. Back to Vanderbilt. Pass to McDaniels. Now here's Russell. Here's Towns. The three is up. And it's Russell. That time on the assist from Towns. Russell's got seven points for the quarter. You love that this guy I'm doesn't I'm get I'm down I'm on himself I'm after a rough first half. Keep your composure and keep grinding. Yeah, yeah, and what a game. Now, I'm not taking anything away from him, but I was actually surprised that defense wasn't able to do more, particularly early. By the time they figured it out, it was too late. He really got in a rhythm and got rolling and never took his foot off the accelerator. Boy, it's not hard to be blown away by his level of play. It's never easy winning on the road, but to do it in this fashion, that's a special performance right there. And keeping us updated from the sideline, Ali LaForce. Hey guys, during that last break, I heard Doc Rivers as he talked with the team. He loves the pressure deep. He told his guys, quote, we've got them on their heels. They're making mistakes. Do not let them get comfortable. We'll see if they can maintain their disruptive ways down the stretch. Back to you. All right, Allie, thanks once again. Here's Maxi. MB drawn the double team. Out to Harris. Let's the three fly. The rebound by the Timberwolves. The perimeter game has failed him thus far. Hit one from range in the first half, but nothing since. And Danny Green gets the whistle that time. That's foul number two for him. And we just got a second look there at an exceptional mobile one block. Oh, showing no signs of giving up this lead. That block sent shockwaves into the opposition sails. Here's Edwards. To the middle. And the basket by Towns. Their ball movement on this run has been tremendous. It's led to a lot of good, clean, open look. The 76ers have got two of eight shots to drop in the final quarter. Embiid is screen on Beverly. Harden the pass to Embiid. And then Embiid with the dunk. And there's the process at work. Embiid rolls off the pick and right into scoring position. Minnesota has gone two of four from the perimeter here in the fourth quarter. Here's Russell. Ooh, he took a hard foul on the shot. So he'll head to the line to shoot a pair. That's his third personal foul. Third team foul. Free throw is good from Russell. And the 76ers making a change here. Dibbles checked in. Taking two shots. And both free throws good for Russell. And to me, the ceiling that D'Angelo Russell has is really high. This guy is dynamic, he's confident, he can score it, and he's just going to continue to want to prove himself. Now here's Embiid. Back to Harris. Knocks down the triple. He's taking what he can get here. Has a three in each half. And so it's Minnesota with it. Down by 12. Stolen by Embiid. And there is a whistle. That goes on Tobias Harris. That's his first foul of the game. And that's only his first miscue of the night. He's been unbelievably steady so far. For Minnesota, they've gone 7 for 11 so far in the fourth. Pass to Vanderbilt. 
Back to Beverly. Towns with the ball. Edwards finds Beverly. Towns with the ball. And Towns slams it home. How about the creativity, the athleticism? That's a rare combination for a guy his size. Go to work, Cat. Ooh, a great look there. Brought to you by the AT&T 5G Slam Cam. Harden, the pass to Embiid. Back to Harden. Hits the layup after the sweet pump fake to freeze the D. Harden's got 14 points here in the second half. Pass to Vanderbilt. Now here's Russell. Vanderbilt with a screen. Outside Russell. Shot clock at two. Oh, Harris with the block. Out of bounds. It's going to be Philadelphia's ball. The 76ers have gone 5 of 11 so far in the fourth. And Harden gets the double team. Harris on the wing. Embiid high post. Towns on him. Four on the clock. And it's Harden. That time on the assist by Embiid. Embiid's got his seventh assist of the game with that last one. Minnesota calls time here. That's a good timeout. They just can't hit anything. Sometimes it just feels like misses become hey, contagious. Man, he wants to settle his guys there. down right now. Bang, your Timberwolves dancer. Here's Russell. Now Towns. Pass to Edwards. Going inside. Oh, he goes up high for the two-handed slam. Well, uh, Anthony Edwards says, yes, you're playing exceptional defense, but my offensive game is better. I'm a solid 225. They've got time on their side here, Grant. And if they're smart, they'll milk the clock a little. Harden, the pass to Embiid. Back to Harden. Shot clock at six. For three, Maxi. Yes, and a nice assist from Harden. Three. Harden's got nine assists in the game. Great passing. Up top, Beverly. Defended by Harden. To the inside. Russell. Got it. Russell's got 16 points here in the second half. What a gamer this guy is. D'Angelo Russell relishing the opportunity to play through contact. Outside Harden. A minute nine left in the fourth. On the take. And he drops in the layup James off the glass. Harden. Harden's got 30 points. And this one hasn't been in doubt for a bit now. They came out on a mission, and you can bag up this win for the 76ers. Their shot blocking was a huge advantage in this game. Yeah, I love the excellent defense in the paint. It led to a lot of key stops. And so this win marks their first victory of the new year. And big time bragging rights won today, just grabbing that season series. And what a huge performance it was for James Harden. What a selfless effort tonight. He's done such a great job finding guys in their appropriate spots. Here's Embiid following the score by Minnesota. And Embiid gets the double team for three. Maxi, no good. Outside Edwards. Here's Vanderbilt. Oh, excellent D there from Harden. Boy, this guy is a good finisher, so he misses a chippy. That's tough to take. Five-second differential between the shot clock and game clock. Embiid is screened on Beverly. Pass to Embiid. Launches a three. Hits the trifecta. And the 76ers lead by 17. What a performance tonight. Getting a win like this on the road is such a boost.
You've got to be able to block out all distractions in enemy That's territory. This team did a tremendous job staying focused on the task at hand. So it's the 76ers today. winning this one easily. Boy, this crowd has to be shocked by the way their team was dismantled. Now, shocked and surprised. It doesn't matter what the matchup is. You never expect a road team to just waltz in and cruise to the type of victory like we saw tonight. Well, folks, that's going to do it for now. For Ali LaForce, Grant Hill, and Doris Burke, this is Brian Anderson. Thank you for watching tonight's game. So long, everybody.